Hello and welcome to Coin Study. This video, How to Grade Barber Half Dollars, highlights the key points to judging condition and defining the grade of your coin, leading to its true value. Here is a view of four Barber Half Dollars ranging in condition starting with the good grade on the left and moving to the uncirculated grade. After the date and mint mark of the coin is determined, collector's attention turns to condition. Varying degrees of wear to the surface is judged and is used to define specific grades. Price points on value charts represent these different grades. Highest in the grading scale is a mint state uncirculated coin. No wear to the surface is evident. The coin is in as minted condition. The key to judging this grade is inspecting the mint luster imparted to the surface during the minting process. Beginning with the uncirculated condition, a close inspection of the entire surface is necessary to detect the presence of wear, as a coin leaves the mint a fine texture forming a shine and luster is present to the surface. In close-up and as the light source is rotated, luster radiates across the entire surface. High points of the design as well as the fields of the coin display luster extending to the rim. Any smoothness from wear changes this texture and reduces the intensity causing dullness. To confirm the mint state grade, inspect the hair detail on Liberty's forehead just above the eye, cheek below the eye, and the jawline from the chin to ear. Trace amounts of wear would show as a hazy dullness and distinct change in color of the silver. Areas prone to first wear on the reverse is the top of the eagle's head and feathers on the neck. Inspect also the tips of the wings and the center tail feather. On mint state examples, fine detail is evident and remains lustrous in these areas. Now let's view an extremely fine grade example. Overall, a nicely detailed coin. However, a small amount of wear is beginning to show on the highest points of the design. Fine details have flattened and luster is faded. Inspect the headband and confirm all letters of liberty are bold, as well as the top and bottom edges of the ribbon are present. Strong detail must remain in these areas to reach this grade. Additionally, a distinct hairline is visible separating the forehead and this distinction extends to the ear. Leaves of the wreath are separated and wear is confined to the edges. Liberty's cap is well defined with just small flat areas on high spots. Moving to the reverse, only the highest points are flattened. The eagle's neck feathers and head are still bold with minor wear showing. Wing feathers are all separated with ample fine lines visible. Flattening is confined to the upper edges of the wing. Tail feathers of the eagle are separated including the center feather. Inspect closely along the bottom edge. Next to examine is a barber half dollar in the fine grade. Moderate wear is displayed and evenly distributed over the entire coin. Minor detail is missing and major detail is beginning to merge. To confirm the fine grade, all seven letters of liberty are visible. ER is often weak along with the headband. Additionally, the Y must show. Hairline above the eye has merged with the forehead and lower leaves of the wreath. However, upper leaves still retain their outline despite missing smaller details. Liberty cap is separated from the leaves with just slight merging. A view of the reverse shows the eagle's head has merged with the neck feathers with a remaining separation of the neck from the shield. Major details separating wing feathers are visible, especially those close to the shield with the edges of the wing smooth and lacking detail. Tail feathers are beginning to merge with some separation remaining. The final barber half is an example in the good grade. A strong outline of the portrait remains, including some major details. Visible is the suggestion of an ear, eye, and a few leaves of the wreath. Often, the rim is faded in areas, but must remain separated from the date, stars, and lettering. 
on the reverse, the eagle is now worn to just an outline with a few areas of detail remaining. All major detail must remain, however. Stars above the eagle are distinct, ribbon in the eagle's beak, arrows and branches in the eagle's talons are all clear from the field. Often the rim is weak on the reverse of a barber half with minor merging with the tops of the lettering. A clear rim and separation of the letters adds to the coin's visual appeal. Viewed all together and in order by grade, a clear difference is evidence from one to the next. Judging and separating your coins by grade is detecting both overall appearance and subtle details. Wide areas of wear may indicate the good grade. Looking closer and detecting the letters of liberty in the headband raises both the grade and value potential of your barber half dollar.